Morning guys, excuse the face, I have just popped on this Lizelle Intensive Nourishing Treatment Mask. I was going to put on my uh, Don't Look At Me, the bright blue one from Lush, but I realised it said used by I think the 8th of this month and it's almost the end of this month and there were tiny little white bits in it and I thought mm, I think that might be mouldy or like on the verge of going quite mouldy so I had to throw it away so I'm going to use this one instead I've just had Delilah's awake from her nap now so um, I'm going to go get the little stinker Is it funny? Oh what have I got on my face? <laughs> What's on my face? Oh we managed to get the blackout blind up but doesn't fit properly so it's not really blackout because there's still little gaps so we're gonna have to sort something out she just slept really well she did an hour straight with no fuss the last two days she wouldn't even go down for her morning nap but of course she goes down for her nap when dog's here at the weekend when i have an extra set of hands to help out you cheeky having a cuddle with daddy um, you guys... is he snapchatting you <laughs> Yeah. We've arrived at swimming. Damn it, it's really windy. I should have put my new wind muffler thingy, my bobby mic cover fluff thing, bob, whatever it's called. Um, so, yeah, we are back at swimming after half term. I, I seem to be filming a lot on Saturdays at the moment. Um, but yes, it is it is swimming now after a week off. I had a nice class. Mm -hmm. Having a little chill chill time after class. A bit wind down time. Swimming lesson. Swimming going up front. Swimming. Yeah. <laughs> you have a good swimming lesson? Yeah. We're swimming on our front, so we? You're lying on that. You're swimming. No. <laughs> <laughs> Dog's had to run to the loo, so we're waiting for him in the car. And um, she was screaming, so I've had to resort to the happy song, which is the only thing that keeps her quiet. As soon as I put it on, she was quiet. Can you see her little feet in the background? It sounds like she's singing. I am off out tonight, that's right. This mama is going out. I'm going out with a girlfriend and I can't remember the last time I went out for a girls night out. It's probably been about four or something years. Yeah, I am trying to find something to wear because um, all the kind of tops I would have worn on a night out before I had Delilah um, no longer fit me and I have like a couple of nice tops at the moment but they're far too summery and I don't really want to wear them out so um, I've picked up these few things I know I'm looking for tops and I've got jeans to try on I'm gonna try on this dress and I'm gonna try on this jumper see what it's like um, I can't really find anything in Topshop I like so I may have to run to I can maybe try a French connection or um, new look, I'm not too sure, but dogs um, driving Delilah around in the car to keep her asleep for maybe another half an hour. Um, so he dropped me off, I've run in, I'm going to try and find something to wear. He's going to pick me back up and then we're going to go over to his parents for the afternoon. <laughs> This jumper is so unflattering. I feel like if I was like a, a cool person, this would look really cool. <laughs> but um, I think this just looks grannyish and lame on me. Ooh, the lighting is very blue. What's going on? Um, I've looked everywhere, cannot find anything. So I've given up the search. I'm just going to have to wear something I already have. 
have. I'm just gonna grab some lunch for Doug and I. We've got to have some before we left for swimming. And then I'm gonna meet him and go to his parents. I've got my favorite macaroni cheese with butternut squash and cauliflower. And then I got Doug a sandwich and some crisps. And then I wasn't gonna get a coffee until the guy went, Carol cappuccino? <laughs> I'm obviously going there far too much now. And I was like, ah, yeah, you know what? Go on, I'll have a cappuccino. So I've got my caramel cap and Doug's got a flat white. Are you watching the rugby? <laughs> you look like the Teletubby baby. Teletubby sunshine thing. Home and um, Doug's taken Delilah out in the pram for her daily evening walk which now gives me a little bit of time to uh, get myself ready I mean I'm, I'm kind of like ready I've got my makeup done but I would like to curl my hair so um let's put my curlers on these curlers are by Tresemme they were about 15 pounds I think I'll try and link them in the description um, I got them about a year ago they're the keratin smooth ones and I like these because um, you don't get a majorly tight curl um, and it, it stays on my hair for like the whole day, somewhat the next day. Um, if you didn't have such thick hair like mine then they'd probably last a bit longer but my hair is quite heavy so it really weighs it down. I find that when I curl my hair a lot either the curls fall out by the end of the day or I have really, really tight curls and I actually prefer what they look like the next day or the day after. But this hair curler is the only uh, curler that I will ha I'll be happy to curl my hair with and go out straight afterwards. Um, I don't know if you remember the, I, had a, I think I had a Tony and Guy conical wand. It was amazing because my hair stayed curly for days. But when I first curled it, the curls were really tight and big. Well, like tight not big but like tight and like my hair was like pff, crazy and i prefer the more relaxed look so yeah if you struggle to find curlers that keep your hair curly this one's really good if you want more of kind of a relaxed um look to your hair i'm gonna try not to use my whole time that i have to myself to chat it and not actually doing anything um so i'm gonna curl my hair oh that's a really old curling glove have i not got another one where's my other one gone so I am off out tonight um, and I'm really looking forward to it. I had to cancel a few weeks ago but I'm quite glad I cancelled a few weeks ago because I wasn't, like I physically felt horrendous just through lack of sleep and mentally I was just feeling a bit um, down really. Um, I'm feeling a bit weird today. I don't know whether I'm coming down with something. Delilah's just gotten over a cold so who knows but i feel like i feel much better in myself i'm not as sleep deprived although i'm feeling really um i'm not feeling sleep deprived at the moment but i am feeling really like i'm lacking energy i think it's just the time of the year i should probably start taking my vitamin d tablets again it's probably that'll probably help i'm just like feeling oh like oh i don't have energy to do anything um but i am feeling a hell of a lot better so yeah i'm glad we're doing our girls night out today because um I'm in a better place for it. I, I feel like I'm going to enjoy it. I am feeling a little bit anxious, not because I'm leaving Delilah. Like, I'm going to put her to bed like I normally would and then go out. Throughout the night, she won't even know that I'm gone. It's only the morning because I've asked. I mean, I'm not planning on having like a huge major night out in the sense that I'm going to be absolutely trolleyed because I don't really want to wake up tomorrow morning feeling horrific. Baby or no baby, I just don't like feeling like that anymore. Like I've been there, done that for a lot of years since I was, I don't know, 15, 16. Um, oh, hey, look at my cool hair. Like I never do this on camera. I, I just look so silly because obviously I won't be going to bed at... 10 o'clock like i normally do i would like to have a bit of sleep in so it means dog's gonna get her up in the morning when she gets up at about half six he's gonna give her a bottle of breast milk that i'll i need to defrost actually and then he'll give her her breakfast which she's never done she's not had a bottle since we've had this new routine and what i don't want to happen is that six o'clock in the morning doug comes in and goes she won't take the bottle she needs to be fed what i'm really worried is that if i do have maybe a few glasses of wine it wouldn't have quite worn off by half six seven in the morning so if she refuses to take the bottle 
I'm worried that then I won't be able to feed her. I don't know. Ow. Ow. Oh, God. Every time. I always manage to burn my temple. Doug filmed his little voiceover bit for my new main channel video. I filmed my everyday makeup and he's done a voiceover for it. By the time you watch this video, it'll definitely be up. So I'll link it at the end of this video. Talking about the end of the video, um, have you guys seen my new end slate? How amazing is it? I love it. It was done by a lovely girl that contacted me on... I don't know whether it was Instagram or whether it was... Was it Instagram? It was Instagram or email no twitter maybe it might have been twitter i know i've spoken to her via like all those platforms i absolutely loved her work she asked if she could do some bits for me and i thought oh yeah because i've really wanted i've really wanted like more of a uh, kind of like a professional professional real professional professional feel to my end slates and my banners and I wanted everything to be consistent and I wanted like consistent what they were called branding except I don't like using the term branding because I'm not a brand I guess it is my job and and all of that and a a client working with me would see me as a brand but yeah I don't like calling myself a brand so I don't like calling all my channel artwork and everything branding but you know what i mean like everything's consistent now so my twitter like um if you go and look on my twitter my banner is the same and um i've got two new banners for this channel and my other channel both both different which i love but still in the same style so they um they connect in a way um, and then i've got two different end slates for this channel and my other channel also even did like um you know the little icon icon i think it's on this side of the screen where I'm putting my elbow here. But on mobile and laptop, there's like a little, um, what they call a favicon, or a um, little icon thing. She even redesigned that for me. So everything's like consistent and I love it. And it's in like my favorite style um, of illustration. It's just totally me and I love it. Oh yeah, I still have so much to do. I managed to, when she napped earlier, I did some like invoices and some editing, but I still got so much got so much to do i wish the weekends were like three days long i know you guys like watching me sit down and chat and have a little ramble i'm gonna hate editing this so much <laughs> it's such a mess in the background oh my gosh i can't really see the screen properly because of this new flipping muff thing my camera looks like it's got a little hairdo <laughs> i didn't realize there's like delilah's bunny on top of the chest of drawers these chest of drawers need to go back into the living room because um, we moved them in here to fit the Christmas tree in, but obviously we don't have a Christmas tree anymore. I'm going to crack on and curl my hair, because um, I'll now do this. <laughs> and curl like this, and I can't talk like this. It's just easier to do it like this. So, yeah. I'll catch up with you guys in a bit. Hair is curled, and I know it looks kind of crazy right now, but it's still hot, so... I'm waiting for it to cool down and then I'm gonna... Why do I keep cutting my head off? I'm waiting for it to cool down and then I can run my fingers through it and zhuzh it up a little bit. Um, Cause yeah, it's not looking too cool right now. But Doug's almost back with Delilah so I'm going to get her dinner ready. Oh, I really need to concentrate on what I'm filming cause I just keep not filming my face. Yeah, it's um, time for Delilah's dinner so I'm gonna get that sorted. What are we going to have today? Crap, I need to get her some more stuff. I'm not gonna lie. Um, She's pretty much been having all her dinners through pouches, um, mainly Ella's Kitchen. I really like the piccolo ones, but they're really hard, they're really hard to get hold of. I can only really, they're not available in my town, um, and I can only really order them online. So yeah, generally we've been having Ella's Kitchen a lot, but yeah, I should probably use up the frozen purees that I had in the, uh, freezer. But really, apart from, um, apart from these pouches, um, she's been having quite a lot of whole foods, like she's been having things like dried bits of toast and like whole bits of fruit and bits and bobs. And today we are going to have macaroni cheese with a hint of basil and possibly a little bit of yoghurt. Didn't actually vlog dinner and whatnot. I'm sure you guys are sick of watching the same thing. Delilah eating dinner, Delilah being fed, Delilah having a nap. Probably because she didn't have much lunch because uh, she was just having a funny episode but um like she's never refused food she was just so upset for some reason earlier she demolished that macaroni cheese she loves that she ate the whole pouch um so before i feed her before bed and like get her bathed and whatnot um i'd quite like to figure out what i'm gonna wear because i feel like what's gonna happen is i'm gonna get her into bed it's gonna be about half seven and then before i know it the taxi is gonna be here to take me back into town and i am not gonna be ready i need to figure out what to wear and i also kind of want to I don't know, probably top up my makeup and also sort out this mess. I've got some washing to put away. There's just mess 
everywhere i just want to sort it out i need to have dinner as well oh my gosh i didn't even think about that i also need to have uh dinner before i before i head out i have this from zara um i have my um my pj bottoms on because i've popped my jeans on a ready to wear wash like a really quick cycle um that washes and dries um your clothes within like an hour because the, i've had those jeans on all day and um they're really baggy and they've got like food on from delilah like flinging her food around so pop those in the wash so they feel a bit nicer um so i don't know like i could just wear this but it just feels really summery it does need ironing though so it is another thing that i'll have to do because otherwise i just don't know what i'm gonna wear oh look this is the little wind muff look <laughs> <sighs> I'm going to iron this top because realistically I have no idea what else I'm going to wear and at least it's got long sleeves so uh, it will keep me somewhat warm and as much as I love this top I just don't like this, the bottom of the sleeves so I roll them up I just I don't know I prefer it like that and this is from Zara for anyone wondering Delilah's in bed I've now got to eat dinner very quickly so then I've got time to get dressed and quickly do a couple of bits before I leave we've got uh, just ready-made fish pie and some veg. I've got about five minutes until my taxi comes. Main thing I need ID. I don't know why dog's watch is in there. Got my lip balm. Got my purse. That's all I need. Morning guys. I realised uh, I didn't end this vlog. It was a nice night out. As you can see I've still got yesterday's makeup on. I just got home and it was about half twelve, one o'clock and I thought mm, no, no I don't want to take my makeup off so I left it on. I used to do that all the time when I was younger, um, but I've, I don't, can't remember the last time I slept with makeup on, so I know it's awful for your skin, but we've all done it, haven't we? Yeah, so it was a bit of a rush to get out of the house. Sorry, Delilah's just had her breakfast and Doug's wiping her face and hands, and she absolutely hates having her hands and face wiped. I had a bit of a lie-in, but to be honest, because I'm so used to waking up at six with her, and sometimes my body wakes up even before that, um, I sort of woke up at six, gave Doug a nudge and said, Lila's up, get up. And then it took me about an hour to fall back to sleep and maybe I had like 45 minutes sleep or something like that. Um, and now I've gotten up and it's half eight. Yeah, it was nice. We didn't end up like going out and like having a boogie or anything. Um, we were quite sensible. I just went to a couple of places. I didn't get ID'd the whole night. We went to three different places and I didn't get ID'd. I, I always go in like ready to like grab it out of my bag and they just go, yeah, go, go through. And it's like, uh, what? <laughs> yeah, and so we spent most of the time just sat down uh chatting i met her at eight and got back about one so yeah um just spent some time chatting and whatnot i don't know how we chatted for that long but we did um we thought we were going to lose our voice at once because we just were having, we were having to shout at each other um we weren't particularly in any like club clubs um but obviously the music's just so loud i've made myself some avocado toast oh so yeah i'm gonna have my toast now i just really wanted to update you guys and um end the vlog properly he's standing <laughs> He's standing. <laughs> you love looking out the window, don't you? <laughs> <laughs>